Hi guys, Amy Star Allen here. And in today's video, I am going to be sharing a question that came up in my Facebook group about whether or not a lead magnet is essential in building an online business. So if you're not in my Facebook group and you want to be surrounded by some awesome online entrepreneurs, I have a Facebook group to support you and I will provide a link to that below this video. So here I am in my Facebook group and this is the question that came in from AJ, is a lead magnet essential to growing your online business? And my short answer is yes. You need a way to build your email list. Your email list is your biggest asset. Having something valuable to offer for free in exchange for an email address is the best way to do it. So if you're building a business online, you know, that my, my thought about building a business online is that yes, your email list is your biggest asset. A lot of times people are just posting links for people to purchase things on social media without actually collecting the email addresses of the people in their target audience. And this is a big mistake because number one, your social media accounts are not owned by you. Have you ever noticed that you're not paying for your social media accounts, right? Your, your social media accounts are owned by the platform that you have those accounts on. And at any time, they can be taken away from you. And we've seen it happen again and again and again. So just because you have a bunch of followers on social media does not mean that you actually have control over that audience. Because number one, your account can, can get shut down. And number two, that platform controls the algorithm. Have you ever noticed how when you po post stuff on social media, not everybody in your audience sees all of your posts, right? So building an email list is the best way to build an asset for your online business that you own, that you have control of. And then what's cool about that is anytime you have something to promote, you can share it with your email list all at once, all in one place, in a place that you actually own that nobody can take away from you. Right? So the best way to build that email list is by offering something really valuable that people would actually pay for, but give it for free online so that all people have to do is provide their name and email address in exchange for your free valuable gift, like a free gift, right? Otherwise known as a lead magnet. So that's what this question was about. Is a lead magnet essential to growing your online business? Now, can you build a business without a lead magnet? Yeah. You could, but I don't suggest it. I know a lot of people that started building businesses online without generating leads, without building their email list, just simply by you know, putting their links to their sales pages and places for people to purchase things out there on social media or whatever without growing an email list. And everybody I know that started doing it this way regrets that they didn't start capturing leads right from the get-go. So what I want to do now is I want to show you how this is done. It's a very simple process of, you know, when you're sharing on social media or when you're sharing on YouTube or any of the places that you're putting yourself out there on the internet, that you're providing a link where people can go to take the next step with you, to get something valuable in exchange for their email address. And now you've got them on your email list where you can stay in touch with them. You can provide more value for them. You can what we call nurture them so that you can con consistently be showing up in their inbox, providing value for them. And then you can also offer them the paid products and services that you offer. So I'm going to give you a few examples of some of the ones that I have. Um, actually, you'll see here, AJ asked me, what do you personally, what do you use personally to entice subscribers with your business? And I said, I have many lead magnets. I use whichever one is relevant for each YouTube video I post. And I also have them available on my blog sidebar. And I include one at the bottom of each blog post and in the body of my posts too. And um, I provided a link to my blog. So I'll show you that first. So if you're on my blog, you'll notice on the sidebar on the right hand side that I've got a bunch of my lead magnets here. These are all banners that I created for the different free offers that I have where if somebody clicks on one of these banners, it takes them to a page where they can put in their name and email address in exchange for something valuable and free from me. And then from here, 
I can share more value with them. I can, you know, I'm going to deliver via email. I'm going to deliver their free gift that they opted in for. That's going to be extremely valuable to them. In this case, it's a checklist to help promote your YouTube videos. But, you know, I have all these, I have 20 simple free offer ideas. I have all these different lead magnets on here, right? So depending on, you know, these are all just on my website and you don't need to have this many lead magnets. I have a lot. I like, you know, I'm constantly creating them because the tool that I use to create them with, which I'm going to show you as well, is make, just makes it super easy. So whenever I feel like I have something that could be a really cool guide or gift that I could offer for my audience, I just create a new lead magnet. But you just have to start out with one. And I'm actually going to show you how to access a training that I have for free where I'm going to show you how to create your first one or another one if you already have some. So this is one place where, you know, where I'm able to capture leads from my businesses on my website, but maybe you don't even have a website. That's totally fine. Another place that I like to do it is in my YouTube videos. Okay. So if I come over to my YouTube channel, you know, I've got all these videos and each time I post a new video, I always like to give people the opportunity to take the next step with me. And I do that in the link or links that I provide below the video. So let's use that YouTube one as an example. Here's a, a one I have about how to promote your YouTube videos for free, right? So here's a video that I have, 10 free and easy ways to promote your YouTube videos for more views, right? So this is my video. And in my video, I let people know that I actually have a free checklist that they can download that comes with a video that walks them through exactly the process that I use. So you'll see here in my links, I have grab my free checklist to help you promote your YouTube videos. And when someone clicks on it, they can download my checklist. So what happens is when somebody downloads this checklist, their email address gets automatically added to my autoresponder, which is a tool that you must have. If you're building a business online, you have to have a funnel builder tool, something that you can build pages like this, as well as an autoresponder platform where you can collect all your email addresses and stay in touch with your audience. And it does things automatically for you. So when someone puts their name and email address in here, it goes over there and my autoresponder automatically sends them their gift. I don't have to manually do it, right? So that's what happens here. And the other cool thing that I can do with this is when they opt in, the first place they're gonna be taken is to a thank you page that lets them know that their free gift is on the way to their email address. And I can use that thank you page to share some of my paid offers with them as well. So here's an example of a thank you page that I have. Awesome, your checklist is on its way to your inbox. In the meantime, check out this once in a lifetime offer. And here's where I sell my YouTube starter kit, which is a course that I created inside of the same platform that I use to create my pages where people can opt in. I can sell my own products. I can create checkout pages. I can create membership sites. I can do all kinds of cool stuff with this platform. It's called the HBA Funnel Builder. It's awesome and I'm gonna provide a link for you below this video if you wanna learn more about that as well. But in this case, this is the thank you page. So it lets them know that the checklist is on its way to their inbox. So they're automatically now being sent an email that's gonna give them access to the checklist. And in the meantime, here's a checkout page if they wanna purchase my course. Not only have I collected their email address, but I've given them, I've still given them the opportunity to purchase, to take another step with me. And so from here, once somebody opts in, you'll see in my autoresponder, I have in my follow-up series, I have an email called, here's your, your YouTube checklist, and it fills in their first name. And then here's the email that they're gonna get. It says, congrats, here's your checklist to help you promote your YouTube videos. Click here to download the checklist. So this is the email that they get automatically from my autoresponder. Once, you know, after they put their name and email address in, they can check their email and then they get this email from me. When they click the button, it takes them to this page where they can download the checklist, they can watch the video that goes with it, they can join my Facebook group, and again, if they want to purchase my YouTube course, they can do that here. So this system is all just working for me. All I have to do is provide value, whether it's on social media or YouTube or whatever, and provide a link to whatever lead magnets I have where people can take the next step with me. So if someone clicks here to download the checklist, you'll see they get taken to a PDF. This is also hosted inside of my, my funnel builder and they can go through these steps that I have in this PDF. So depending on what I'm talking about, I use primarily YouTube to generate leads, but I, I also generate leads from my social media platforms. 
So depending on what I'm talking about, I can share a link to whatever lead magnet is relevant, right? I always share my, my lead magnets in my bio, whether I'm on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, all of the, the social media platforms that I'm on, I always have this links page that people, when they click on it, it takes them to a page with all of my stuff on it. Like, you know, my five day freebie challenge. And then I've got my 30 minute workday escape plan, all of these different lead magnets that I've created. They're just right there in my social media bio, as well as on my, on my blog. Right. But I also use one specific link for each piece of content that I create. So what I recommend is if you don't have a lead magnet yet, create one that's kind of generic, one that no matter what your content is about, you can always let people know about it. So in other words, if you're in the skincare niche, maybe create a free guide that has something to do about like, you know, your, your morning skincare routine or something, you know, some type of a guide that would be helpful for people, regardless of what you're talking about. So, you know, you might be doing a video about something on a specific skincare topic or a post on social media about a specific skincare topic. But at the end of the post or at the end of the YouTube video or at the end of the Facebook Live video or whatever, you can say, and by the way, I'm super passionate about skincare. And if you'd like to get access to my morning skincare routine that's made the hugest difference for me in my life, I've got a free checklist for you that you can download. And I'm providing the link below this video or you can provide the link in your social media post or whatever. And so then what happens is somebody has gotten value from your post, they've gotten value from your video, and now you're giving them the opportunity to take it a step further and download your checklist. And once they do that, now they're on your email list. And now you can stay in touch with them. Now you can continue to send them skincare tips and you can continue to offer them some of the products and services that you sell. So in this example, if you are you know, if, if you have a guide that's got something to do with skincare, you could have on your thank you page. Another idea that you can do on your thank you page is to have a video saying, hey, I'm so glad that you downloaded the guide. It's on its way to your email inbox. And in the meantime, if you're impatient like I am and you want to get results even faster, I have a product that I swear by that I've been using. I've gotten great results with it. You know, you, in the video, you could share some testimonials of other people or whatever and say, if you're interested in learning more about this product, click the link below this video and you can learn more about the product there and purchase it if you choose to. So just like I did with my YouTube checklist on the thank you page, you could be you know, letting people know to go check their email to get their free guide, but then also giving them the opportunity to purchase a product that's relevant that you sell. And then the cool thing is once they're on your email list, you can continue to follow up with them and you can continue to offer them valuable products and services that you sell because you know that they're a member of your target audience, right? Now you're marketing to people who have raised their hand and said, yes, I want that free guide. And what that tells you is that because they've done that, you know that they are a member of your target audience. They're interested in more information about skincare. It's not just anybody on social media. It's the specific people that are interested are the ones that are going to opt in. So now you've got an email list of targeted audience members. So here's an example. This is just a quick demo page that I created for a training that I did. For example, so if you're, if you're giving away a guide for 10 foods to reduce inflammation, right? When they opt in, this would be the thank you page. Your 10 foods to reduce inflammation guide will be delivered to your inbox in the next five to 10 minutes. But while you wait, please watch this important video first. And then I tell them to look for an email from me. And then this would be the video where I would be letting them know about this incredible product that I have that can also help them reduce inflammation. And then this button would be the button below that they could click to purchase that product. So hopefully you're starting to understand how this, how valuable this process is. So you are, over time, you're building an audience, you're building an email list of people who are targeted audience members, people who have exchanged their name and email address to say, yes, I'm interested in that free guide that you have, which shows you that they are members of your target audience and gives you the opportunity to follow up with them on a regular basis, continue to provide value for them so that if and when they are ready to purchase something, you're right in front of them and you're the go-to person. You're the authority in your niche. And this is also going to help you to stand out. You know, if you're in a network marketing company, for example, there's probably 
a lot of reps in the company promoting the same products and services, right? But if you could have a free guide that you're offering that people don't have to pay for, but you're providing some valuable information about whatever it is that your products and services provide for people, then you're going to stand out and it's going to be something that people can't get anywhere else. It's going to, it's going to be a one of a kind guide that was created by you so that you can start to develop that relationship with people. So I hope you're starting to see the value in this. And I wanted to let you know that I actually recently did a five day training where I walked people through one piece of the equation each day for five days to build their first lead magnet or to build an additional lead magnet if you already have one. And I went through all of the steps that I just showed you where I, on day one, I taught how to come up with the perfect idea for your lead magnet, for your freebie, right? And I gave some really powerful exercises that you can do to come up with something that is going to be really valuable for your audience. So that's what we did on day one. On day two, we created the opt-in page so that we could capture that contact information of our target audience members. On day three, we created a bridge page, which is that thank you page that I told you about where you can introduce yourself and provide next steps for your audience, maybe even offer them your paid services. On day four, I showed how to connect your opt-in page to your email autoresponder and create that welcome email that I showed you where you could deliver your free gift. And on day five, I showed you how to set up the delivery page and how to host your PDF or your guide and how to add paid offers to the guide itself so that when people are going through your free guide, you could also have in there links to your paid products and services as well. Right, so here's another example of a PDF that I created and throughout it, I have links to all, it's, this is a free guide. It's a really value packed guide of 16 places to gather targeted leads online. And I go through all of these things, but I also throughout it, I have links to anything that's relevant. So you know, here I have a link to join my Facebook group. Here I have a link to my YouTube checklist because it's, I'm talking about it in that paragraph. And then here I also show them how to purchase the tool that I use. So I have a link to purchase it in this guide. I have a link to purchase it here. So within our guide, we can start to, you know, we're giving away free value, but we can also start to share our paid products and services with people as well. So what I've done is I've taken the five days worth of training that I did, that it was a live, it was a live five day challenge. Eventually it's going to become a paid course, but for now I'm offering it for free. It's a free five day challenge that you can just grab. You can go through it on your own, at your own pace, on your own schedule. And over the course of five days, I chunked it down to, you know, five steps so that over the course of five days, you can just do a little bit each day. And by the end of the five days, you're going to have your first lead magnet or an additional lead magnet ready to go so that you can start generating leads from the people in your target audience. So I'm really excited to offer this to you. I'm gonna leave a link below this video where you can just go ahead and opt in, and sign up for this free challenge. And like I said, you're gonna go through these five days worth of training, and by the end of the five days, you're gonna have your first freebie funnel. So again, is a lead magnet essential to growing your online business? As far as I'm concerned, yes, it is. It's the way that you're going to build an email list full of targeted audience members so that you can stay in touch with them, so that you can follow up with them, so that you can continue to provide value for them, regardless of what niche you're in. You know, like let's say you're a realtor. Let's say you provide some type of a guide about the best neighborhoods for schools, grocery stores, or, or whatnot, and you provide that in all of your online marketing material so that you start to build an email list of people who are obviously, if they're opting in for your guide, showing you that they're interested in buying or selling real estate in that market. And now you have a way to send them emails and value. And so when they're ready to buy or sell, you're the top of mind realtor, right? You're the one that comes to mind. So we can do this in any niche. This is a very, very valuable skill. So I highly encourage you to just go ahead and click the link below to go through the five day challenge and get your first lead magnet built. I'm also gonna provide a link to the HBA Funnel Builder, which is the platform that I use to create all of my lead magnets, to create all of my paid offers, membership sites, 
it does everything, right? It also hosts our PDFs for us and our audios, like free gifts that we're giving away, we can actually host them on there as well. So you can actually even build a business if you don't have a website because this builder literally hosts everything for you as well. So I will provide a link to that below and I'm gonna provide a link to the five day challenge below and I hope to see you in the five day challenge. Definitely let me know if you have any questions or anything that I can help you with. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video.